One of the students came up with the idea for the project, which was to grow seedlings as part of their Canberra Camp fundraising. We had uh, an idea and a student who uh, involved uh, her friends and they came up with something which they thought was going to be really successful and that they could share with others. First we made, a, made the greenhouse and then we got the seeds ready and planted them and watered them. The first time they didn't get enough sunlight so they didn't really um, grow very much and then the second time they didn't really get enough water and they're a bit dead. Sometimes things don't work and you just have to try again to try something different to see if it works. So their failing was far more of a learning than a disaster. They learned to be resilient, they learned to identify the problems and they also really had to come together and reform their vision so that they could uh, change their project in, in a small way and still be able to take to the community what they were hoping to achieve in the first place. We're going to give them seeds and instructions on how to plant and grow their own vegetables and then it will come with like some recipes that they can use them ingredients in. From students that I first saw as friends, they in some regards have also become business partners and their conversations are honest and they are respectful and ultimately I think that they have therefore been really successful as learners. Entrepreneurial education has been basically the catalyst for all of those things. So if we're able to offer it to all of our students, then I think that we as educators have pretty exciting times ahead.